Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh wa hamdulillahi rabbil alameen Again, it's a Sunday, we're in Speaker's Corner, ladies and gentlemen. Firstly, I would like to address the people that try to approach me to speak about Islam. Number one criteria, if you're going to come to me to speak about Islam, please do your research before you come to me to speak about Islam. It's very, very simple, inshallah ta'ala. Number two, please do not be ignorant and raise your voices and show bad language and body language, inshallah ta'ala. Please, when you speak to me, speak to me with a little bit of intellect or a little bit of knowledge. I'm getting a lot of people in Speaker's Corner that want to dialogue with me and they don't have the hikmah or the wisdom even when it comes to their Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah Even when it comes to their knowledge, they don't have knowledge. Whether they're Christians or whether they're whatever they're following, they don't have facts. SubhanAllah. So, I'm just finding it kind of crazy that every time I come here and I try and have a civilized conversation, you're getting individuals from different faiths that are not only abusing the Muslims, not only disrespecting the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi to a different degree, and I can understand in speaker's corner, SubhanAllah, but at least when you speak to a real Muslim, uh, may Allah SWT make me be of those that are going to be pious, inshallah, that can enter Jannah, inshallah, with no reckoning, Amin. that you come to us with a kind approach, a loving approach, and, you know, speak with intellect. People, I asked a gentleman a question today, in speaker's corner which was if you are a devout christian right and you believe that jesus which we believe is salam alhamdulillah one of the most greatest messengers before the prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam if you believe that he is god then prove it to me so my question to this gentleman was show me a verse in the bible where jesus says i am god worship me alone with no partners allah says in the quran I am Allah, worship me alone with no partners. Subhanallah. This is the facts, this is Islam, this is the Quran and the Sunnah, the teachings of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam at its finest degree, you see. Islam is very, very easy. But I've noticed people in this park, they will make Islam look very difficult. Guys, the message to the world is, pray your salah, okay? Study underneath, you know, ulama or some sheikhs that are reputable sheikhs in your communities someone that's educated that has studied in the school of Medina at least please and come here with correct information because the people that are here they will discriminate a majority of the facts and the haq and unless you know what you're talking about it will be extremely difficult on camera to defend yourself Malas Patala bring nothing but justice Malas Patala bring nothing but peace tranquility, love and affection in our homes and our families and inshallah help the whole of the Ummah of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam for we believe in Ashhadu an la ilaha illallah wa ashhadu anna Muhammad rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam we believe that this kalama outweighs the Jannah we believe that this kalama outweighs the Paradise we as Muslims should be an example in our society I don't come down here to have a, a day out this is not a day out this is a form of dawah, an opportunity for real Muslims to come out here and invite others to Islam. And that's my objective here, not to debate. Please do not come to me if you're on a debate. Just come to me if you want to learn about Islam, inshallah. Jazakallah khair, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Big shout out to Black Dunya, the brothers did excellent work. Help the brothers, inshallah, in Speaker's Corner, they come out here every single week to try and make these videos, inshallah, as well. Likewise, and support the movement, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.